Hey guys, this is Bobo the Vulture, and uh, this is Let's Play Castlevania Aria of Sorrow, and we just got going on it. I'm some high school transfer student that was staying in Japan, and then uh, I got absorbed into a solar eclipse, or no, a lunar eclipse. Wait a minute, this is freaking Hatoful Boyfriend Holiday Star all over again. Bah! I appear to be getting uh, good-natured ribbing from the rest of the click team um, over uh, my intros and outros for all of you folks watching on YouTube in the future. Don't worry, guys. I still love you, even if you can't be here right now. Ooh, Blue Crows. I bet Blue Crows have nice souls. What an interesting thing. Ald has no love in his heart for anyone. That's alright. Well, hey there, friend. Oh my, aren't you a dashing figure. Is it just me, or does that cape kind of look like a giant foot flying out of his back? Can we make this leap with our special armor? Hurt! This does seem to be something of an issue, doesn't it? There's a button to activate blue souls. Damn it! One of the shoulder buttons. Oh, it'll be R in that case, because uh, L. L already does back dashes, so. Would you look at that? Not afraid to sneak behind you. As though that were a thing that required real boldness. Wow, that zombie was itching to soldier. And axe armor is being taken out of the mana for us. Okay, that's actually kind of creepy. Those zombie soldiers appear to be like, I don't know, World War II soldiers? That guy definitely had like a, uh, There we go. Leather plate. It was not a blue eyes white dragon, it's true. Alright, leather plate. Good. Even better defense. Defense. Everybody wants better defense, right? We're all about the D. Beam does not allow image embedding on chat, Ald. That is the one thing it does not do. 
It will do anything for love, but it won't do that. Let's stay ducked until that goes by. Yeah, that seems wise. does not believe in his legs. That they're worth it. If you don't believe in your legs, how will any of us? Level up, bitches. Ouch. That was kind of a foolish move. Whee! Nope. Whee! Nope. Man, I got nice cool landing poses there. Oh, you know what I? Why am I doing this the hard way? I should be fighting bones with bones. I really should. Those bones pack quite a wall on that guy. It's a rakish scarf. It's warm and cozy, nice and toasted. Yeah, this is the uh, this is the final Castlevania game for the Game Boy Advance, which is you know I guess where it ended up uh, in the at least the two-dimensional uh, versions of the game ended up uh, landing after. Hey, potion! I managed to reach it after all. Nope. Forever alone. So I get the soul of having, uh... So I get the soul of having double jump or whatever. This was the, uh... This is the final one for the Game Boy Advance. Uh, being played here on the Castlevania Double Pack. Um, the second... I think a terrible track record against those bats. I've previously played Circle of the Moon and um, Harmony of Dissonance. Zerfall is desperately trying to get what I'm going to have to assume is his uh, gif of Chibi Revolver Ocelot, but uh, I can't exactly know for sure. We got no other way to go down that direction. Oh, I know for sure, because I'm pretty good after all. Yeah, look at this guy. This zombie soldier is... Oh, shit! He's got pineapples! Yeah, so there you go. This game has, uh... Future soldiers. Well, not future soldiers, but like soldiers that uh, would have appeared in the world uh, after the time of the original Castlevania games.
Ooh. Got ghost magic. That's pretty good. I also took the $50 he was going to leave his wife. That's right. I mean, his wife is gone now, too. He did not look like a modern soldier for 20... What I imagine a soldier would look like in 2035. So, let's see. 12, 8, 16. Let's give Ghost a shot and see how it does for us. Well, the next time we need one. Well, those guys did me a fat lot of good, didn't they? Ooh, we actually did do something. get up there yet don't have the uh, don't have the strengths necessary I'm oh, being hosted all right Bam! 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 I was about to say uh, at this rate I should be getting a uh, zombie soul pretty soon now that I can one shot these guys should not be a bragging point, and yet, here we go. Pretty good sound effects for all the uh, different characters uh, getting chopped up and hatched a bit. I can jump back down. Okay, so uh, that didn't work quite the way that I wanted it to. What if I use skeleton bones? Hooray, I can get small hearts. being a dick. Huh. Let's uh, go back to the ghost spirit, see whether or not it would actually uh, back me up in a... Right, there you go. Check out these little irritating flying guys. Ah, oh, good. Thank goodness that ghost helped uh, help me out there, because uh, that guy was being a uh, uh, difficulty. Source of uh, bother. A spot of bother. Chatelet is so low, so you know I'm slow. Right. I think I want to make sure that I make this. Because I'm guessing, yes, here we go. A nice room of just hanging out. I want that right now. After all the amount of work that I've done. I get the sense that I could continue just doing that repeatedly until I had the soul of that particular character. I guess there's such a thing as having a 100% soul run of this game. I don't know if that's what I want to get involved in. Ooh. 
you don't want to 100% soul this game at all. I bet there are some pretty interesting souls and, like, useful souls. Possibly game-breaking souls somewhere or another in this... in this old game. Ah, I now have water pist- I have water gun! I'm a squirtle! Possibly useless souls, just like real- Oh, guys. Really good soul from a giant armor enemy. I hope it's like a total toy one. Spend half an hour farming a single soul and then it's useless and you question your life choices. I believe that. Or you could do the thing. <clears throat> Here we go, a merman. Yeah, check this mess out. Ooh, and I can attack now using supersonic waves! Five hundred bucks. If I eventually find out there's a shop, which there probably will be, but uh, you get multiples of the same soul. Sometimes the soul's effect will get stronger, more damage, less MP. Okay, so there are different levels of soul. See, this is why we want to have chat. This is why Beam works. This is why streaming live and getting real feedback—that's the the kinds of handiness that when I'm stumbling blind through a game like this. I'll find out. That's right, die to my water gun, World War II soldier man. Crank that soldier boy. My name is Graham. Let's just say I'm a missionary. Oh, uh, I'm Soma, Soma Cruz. You weren't here in this shrine before, were you? How did you get here? I'm not sure. I went through the shrine gate and BOOM! I was here. I see. Uh, can I ask you a question? Go ahead. I don't mind. Is it true that this is Dracula's castle? It most certainly is. But isn't Dracula's castle in Europe somewhere? In theory, yes. But his true castle exists somewhere else. His true castle? Yes. It's a well-known fact in the underworld. Do you believe in vampires? Well, uh, no. I thought the story of Dracula was made up, actually. No, it's, it's all true. It was leaked to the outside world. Usually, the church handles these things with utmost secrecy. <laughs> Over the course of time, Dracula has resurrected many times. When people lost faith, craved chaos and destruction. <laughs> so... Are you trying to tell me that Dracula's been resurrected? Yeah, that's right. It's a random missionary that survived in Dracula's castle. And, uh, by the way, he's here to tell you how great the Underworld is. He didn't say what he was a missionary for. 
He's a missionary for Dracula, going out to spread the word of how cool Dracula is. No, Dracula perished in 1999. He just couldn't bear to deal with partying like it was something else after that. You know of the prophecy of 1999, don't you? Yeah. The prophecy of 1999. Do you guys remember 1999? Some of you at least were around then, yeah? The prophecy of 1999 was on New Year's on New Year's Eve, all the computers were going to shut down and planes were going to like crash out of midair because uh, nothing was uh, nothing was controlling them or something. Nostradamus's great prophecy? Oh, that was the Weekly World News stuff. That's right. Dracula was resurrected exactly as pro as he predicted, but vampire hunters destroyed him completely. They ended his regeneration cycle by sealing his castle. Symbol of his demonic power inside the darkness of an eclipse. And that eclipse is where we are now? Yes, but there's still more to the story. There's more? But wait, there's more. In the year 2035, a new master will come to the castle, and he... So 15 years, folks. Put it on your calendars will inherit all of Dracula's powers. But that's... This is not how Dracula is described in Vampire Hunter D. No, there's a lot less nudity. Yes, that time is now. I better get going. Is that all then? Uh, yes, thank you. Farewell and be careful, but remember... Your time is up. Your time is now. Uh, yes. You too. <laughs> You're the 666,666,666 visitor. Congrats, you get a free book of prophecy. Oh, dear. There are a lot of Bashonen, uh, sort of appearing characters in this game. It's, it's true. He's wearing that fur because it's the future and it's cool. Peter's going to be very mad. Well, you never know. Zerf, this may be faux fur. Man, the, uh... Oh, by the way, why don't you come with me to the chapel? That doesn't look like the sturdiest staircase. Thankfully, this is not uh, Demon's Crest, and the room is not getting darker every time I knock over a candle. Oh, hi! You know, I bet that guy is still uh, deal withable, but uh, maybe we want some help. Oh, wait, we could attack using s supersonic waves. How's that? Oh, I see. That's kind of cool, but uh, not exactly uh, knocking me out of the park. Oh, come on. Oh, dear. That was quite a fall, wasn't it? Two more characters to meet. Alexandra thinks you will like them. 
I think he's trying to say that they might be a little bit shown in two. Yay! Guys, why do you guys all feel so threatened by the, uh, Fire Bashonan missionary friend? So there is a big old room up here. Well, all right, uh, it's all for you, Duraga. Duraga, now we can throw katanas. And we've got a new soul, everybody. New soul, woo! Throw out a couple of souls sometimes. Okay, your uh, set off with proximity alarm. Is that the story here? Oh, I gotta figure out how I can jump ever so delicately to get up there and get that super sweet sword. That super sweet sword, you guys! Gotta toss a few souls out here and there, no biggie. Hey! That's how, uh... That's how we operate. We have a rapier! Let's take a look at our rapier. I have a rapier wit. It's a sword made for stabbing. And that's just what it'll do. One of these days, this sword is gonna stab all over you. That's got a nice swing on it, too. Wait, did I not go all the way over to the left in this room? That seems like an oversight. Time to get scabby. I fear I'm capable of getting all the way over to uh, this corner of this room. Unless there's something that I'm missing right now. little teeny room over here. Is it a save room? It is a save room. Excellent. Let's save the game. And we will break this video for YouTube. When we come back next time for YouTube, uh, we are going to continue to explore the exciting world of this exciting world. Walk, 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 walk. I know, it's been fun so far. I got a nice little stabby sword. And uh, we met uh, a new friend. Um... So that was all right. <laughs> Met a new Bashonen friend. Anyways, folks, this is Bobo the Vulture. This is Let's Play Castlevania Aria of Sorrow. Right? I do get the names of them confused after some time. 
But thanks very much for watching, everybody, and I'll see all of you next time. Bye for now.